Hey everyone, Jolt here. Doesn't this look just awesome? I got this picture from Alex from cohort 12 of the Visual Thinking Workshop. He's one of the very first users of the new feature in Excalibur Obsidian 2.8.0. You can now print to PDF, you can print over multiple pages, and you can also print your slides. Now imagine you have a big presentation like this one here. This was, by the way, my presentation at the PKM Summit in Utrecht in 2024. And take note that the PKM Summit in 2025 is happening again in Utrecht, the Netherlands. But in terms of printing, let me show you the two different type of features you have. So first, if I want to print this page to PDF, I need to click here on the tray menu and I need to click export image. Now in export image, you're now going to see two tabs, image and PDF. The PDF tab is only available on the desktop. Here you can see that I can set the size of the page. It's now set to A4. I can set the orientation to be a landscape or portrait. I can set different sizes of pages. So now I'm going to fit the image to maximum four pages because I think this is going to look nice on four landscape A4 sheets, but you have other options here as well. I'm going to use a normal margin. You can set the paper color. I'm now going to set the paper color to use the scene color. So that's this brown around here. And I can position the image on this larger sheet or if you fit to page then on the page uh, wherever you want. So I'm going to now position this to the top left of the page. Now, additionally, if I want, I could add a padding. I'm not going to do that now because I have the margin anyway. And I could also set the image scale. If I set the scale, it only has an effect if I choose use image scale in the page fitting setting. And now if I click export PDF, then I'm going to be prompted for the name of the file. I'm just going to save this. And depending on the speed of your device and the size of your image, the export can take a little while, but you can see it was pretty fast. And so you, here you can see that this is now printed on four pages and it's nicely cut at the right points. You can, of course, slice the page and fit the page together nicely. But if you want, of course, you can get rid of the margins, etc. Now, the other feature I want to show you is this is also a presentation. So I'm using the slideshow script. I'm going to include a link in the description if you're not familiar with the slideshow script. But so the slideshow script converts your drawing into a crazy like presentation where you can navigate this with, yeah, simply pressing the arrow buttons. And so this is a nice presentation experience. But now what I want to show you is here you have this printer button and you have two ways of printing. If I just click the print button, then it's going to print in HD resolution. So this is a screen presentation ready format. But if you hold down the shift, then it's going to use the current presentation size because the positioning of items in the presentation depends on your screen size. So just to know if you would press print with shift, then it would actually print it in the exact size as I can see it here. I'm now going to print it in HD. Now this printing takes a little while in this case because I have a large image and the logic that happens is it takes a bit of time, but I'll just give it a minute and the image is ready. So it did take a bit of time, but this is a huge presentation with lots of images. And here you can see that you from page to page, this is the presentation and it 
was presented it's all on separate slides and this way you can just simply flip through them as normal slides and there you have it it's i think an awesome feature so these were the two key features i wanted to share there's also lots of other goodness in terms of integration with pdf plus plus and how now xcolidraw can handle rotated pages and all sorts of funny page sizes as well as there are some new features in how frames are used and how items are grouped and a number of other small fixes so enjoy xcolidro 2.8.0 and enjoy the pdf printing functionality i think it's awesome thank you